a dog in a dress. <laughs> Look at her. Look how cute it is. <laughs> how does that? <laughs> this is what we got to get Maddie, that dog. I would laugh every time I saw that dog. It is so funny. How is it holding itself up for so long? These are actually really good. Oh my. Isn't that so funny? That's freaking me out. <laughs> I love I it. My own boy. I want that dog. Hey guys, I'm Jameson, and this is Jamie, and this is our weekly wrap-up Week number... 22. 22, the old deuce deuce. I knew you were going to say that. Okay, week 22. This um, week, it's been more of a, I would say like a planning-ish week, more yeah. than a product... I mean, it's been productive, but we're planning. We're not so much like... We got, we started kind of laying out the electrical. We talked about that in the last weekly update about how we were laying out switches and so on and so forth. Then we started talking about um, where we wanted to put TVs and where we, I, I, I'm kind of getting into the networking side of things, being the geek that I am. I want to know how to plan out all of this stuff. Where are the access points going to go for the, you know, we're not doing a, a traditional router. We're just going to do access points within the house that distribute the Wi Fi much mm -hmm. more evenly and, you have one nice big network and it's... I don't know anything about this. All I know thing, is he people. keeps asking me like, thing. are you going to be listening to music in the, the kitchen? The other thing that Do I wanted to plan out... Do you want to control out, the volume on a wall? I don't know. The, I have no idea. The other thing that I wanted to plan out was our... Um, Smart home built features, in, I guess. Yeah? yeah, our built-in home audio. So we want audio kind of like in the living room, in the kitchen, the main areas that we're going to be hanging out, out on the back decks. Um, probably the master bathroom, bathroom area to mm -hmm. listen to have something to listen to while you're getting ready um, and the basement areas basically they make so many different ways to connect to your whole whole home audio um, but now with the technology um, kind of transforming into what it is you've got you've got Apple um, that now just came out with the new airplay 2 technology which is going to they haven't released it yet but it's going to mm -hmm. be or you can do multi-room audio and stream to different Apple TVs, or we've got Alexa. And basically what we need Look, is... she's now going to ask you a question because you said her name. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, to, and I'm going to say Alexa many more times in this, and she's just going to wake up every time I say it. Um, but with, with the different technologies now, basically you just need a place to plug in these technologies and connect to the built-in speakers. Mm -hmm. So the, the different, whatever source it is, basically, I just want to have a line in in each room so that I can plug in my Alexa or my uh, Apple TV or whatever it may be. And then that connects to the built-in speakers. Um, however, you know, you have, still have to run through an amplifier or whatnot. But, so there's a lot of planning as far as that. I won't go in, I already went into a whole bunch of detail, but I won't go into any more detail on mm -hmm. that. Um, what else did we do? Oh, we released the first um, cabinet in our kitchen renovation series for the flip house. The flip house. Yeah. Um, and it was just a seven inch slim cabinet. It went right beside our stove. Mm -hmm. And that's a good place for baking trays and baking sheets trays, and yeah. all those things. Um, so we're going to release several other cabinets, base cabinets, upper cabinets. Um, how to make end panels for the sides, mm -hmm. uh, but basically the we built cabinet. yeah the corner, corner cabinet. Yeah. Oh, lazy Susan. Yeah, sure. Whatever. It was, um, yeah. The what crown molding around the top. We built we built all the cabinets ourselves. We did not do the doors. No. Uh, we got into a bit of a time crunch. It was something I kind of wanted to do, and then the more I thought about it, I was decided that. Well, we did the drawer or the door faces on um, the vanities. Yeah. Yeah. We did do those doors and those turned out really great, but for a whole kitchen and we we're just really wanted to wrap up the house, the easiest thing for us to do at that point was to just order the doors mm -hmm. and we painted them ourselves. We finished them, yeah, finished mm -hmm. them to match. So go check that out. We will link somewhere. You can look and find that link, I'm sure. Um, also, the other thing that we released was our first episode. Our very first episode for the Dream House build. So if you've been following along with these 
weekly updates and you kind of know what's going on as it's happening. But I want you to go back and check out this first episode of the Dream House build. It's going to detail um, everything that's led us up to this point and the well, not, not to this point, up, yeah. led us up to the beginning right before we built. So like kind of how we got where we are. Um, it's going to detail the site layout and permits and all that stuff, mm -hmm. uh, how we picked a plan um, and pouring, then excavating digging, yeah, and, and pouring the foundation walls and pouring the foundation walls. So go check that out. That will definitely be linked below or above if you're on Facebook. Um, well, the other thing we've been planning this week is our kitchen layout. Mm -hmm. So we have been working with uh, Click Studios online as our kitchen for our kitchen layout which is kind of a it's been kind of fun i yeah, don't know it has i mean we so, had a general idea but then you kind of just give them all your dimensions of your kitchen and we sent them our plans yeah so we've got basically you can we sent him our plans and gave those gave them those dimensions and then he came up with a rough idea we gave him like our appliances and stuff that we yeah, were planning on i gave using. him a list of all of our appliances and he gave us a, a rough plan mm -hmm. um which and we then just we actually met with him changed, this afternoon. <laughs> Not really. I mean, we changed some stuff, some things up. Yeah. But um, I mean, it's 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 cool to be able to work. It's and he just did this whole like screen share thing, so we could kind of rework some things. Yeah, and, point to exactly what we time. wanted to change and how we wanted them. So, yeah, I think we are we are going somewhere with our kitchen layout. I feel. Yeah. I feel pretty good about it. Yeah, and the nice thing about it is that the design consultation is free. So mm -hmm. whether we decide to go with Click Studios or not, we've still got a kitchen design that we worked out with a designer. Yeah. We also released the um, a couple other flip house projects. We released the master shower renovation. And that's going to detail um, the how the tile and everything that went in to waterproofing the shower with the Schluter product product. Uh, tiling it and then installing the shower door and whatnot. And we also released another video and blog post about the um, heated tile, the heated tile floor in the entryway. Yeah. So the entryway of the flip house was not, it was an addition from the original house mm -hmm. and it didn't have any HVAC. So there was no heating and air. Um, so what we opted to do was heat the floor in order to temper that room in the winter um, and just you know, it, it acts as like an air, an airlock entryway. Yeah, because so there is two. There's a, the front door, then you have the entryway or the mudroom area, mm -hmm. and then there is another front door that leads you into the house. But that room would have been way too cold in the winter alone. Yeah. So we decided to heat the floors in there. Um, yeah, and it worked out really it, good. So go yeah. check out that video to see exactly how, how we did it. So that pretty much concludes our weekly wrap up and as far as like all the things that we've done and put out here in the past week or however long it's been since our last weekly wrap it's up. It's been a week. Is it? Um, but I want you guys to start to get excited about all the things that are still to come. So we've got a lot, um, we've got more episodes for the Dream House build. Uh, episode two and three are gonna be following along here pretty soon as well as all the kitchen renovation uh, videos. All that stuff is gonna come out very soon and we're excited to share it with you all. Until next time. Be safe and happy building. We'll see y'all next week.